this is Sadah here, your host for uh, for the series, and we are learning Laravel Das. Um, let's move forward and discuss our toolkit. Um, okay, to start with, I don't think we can really call it a toolkit if it's just one tool. So, I mean, um, I think there is only one tool that we will be using across the uh, series, and and this is not something that you're not very familiar with. As you know, with most things testing, you know, sometimes people get scared right from the start. Oh, you know, you never know what we're going to use and everything. So it's nothing else. Uh, we're just going to use our good old Visual Studio Code. So using Spotlight, we have just opened uh, VS Code. And what we're going to do is, as you can see, you can see a terminal here. And yeah, you can see a terminal here, and this terminal is going to be used for most of our uh, most of our series for running tests and everything. And on top of that, there is one more thing that I want you guys to use, and which is going to going to make your life a lot a lot easier, and that is Beta PHP Unit um, by Califojo. Califojo, who is he? Oh yeah, that's the guy who made who made. Alpine JS and Laravel Livewire. So if you don't know him, you've really been sleeping in the rock. Yeah, don't worry, a lot of us do. Um, but okay, so better PHP unit. So just go to the extension sections in VS Code and just search better PHP unit and you you will find the extension there. So just, you'll just see a green button here where you see uninstall like with me because I already have it installed. You can just click on uh, install and that will install the extension for you and that's pretty much it. Um, now, uh, th this is going to be a great help when you're going to run your test individually. For example, so you can just do a quick, a quick, uh, you know, a control shift P and enter and then that particular test runs. Instead of, you know, you having to do PHP arts and dust, yeah, in the beginning, that's fine when you have about a couple of tests, but but if you have about 20 to 20, you know, 10 to 20 tests, and then you want to run a particular test, then you have to run these first commands and all that, and you don't really want to get into that. So what you will do is you'll go to that particular test, you'll do a control shift P and do an enter, and that particular test only will run. So this is going to make your life a little more, a little more easier. If you are the command type, or if you don't like VS Code for any reason, I'm not here for editor wars. Um, you can, that's perfectly fine. You, you can just go on with your, uh, with your editor of choice. It's just that you'll probably have to, uh, you know, install, uh, something, uh, along, along the lines of this. If there is something available, really, because this, this PHP, um, this better PHP unit extension is basically for VS Code. And this is the guy, by the way, this is the great Kali who's, who's done Darwell Livewire, who's done Alpine JS. And I don't know about the rest of these, sorry. Uh, but yeah, I've been, I can, uh, I, I, I cannot be thankful enough. I'm actually more thankful than others for, uh, to him for this extension because this has really helped me in the daily, daily workflow it does. So that's pretty much it about tools. Let's move on to the database setup. Mm -hmm. 